distributors include home and state All right, we're heading to the store. We'll see what's going down up here. Senior care services, from bathing and medication providers to Alzheimer's care. More at homeinstead.com slash NPR. And the Corporation for Public Broadcasting. And you are listening to expanded coverage of the arrival of Hurricane Irma on WUSF 89.7 and WSM 5.1 so and 3 o'clock. You can listen to us on the websites of each of those stations, WUSF.org. It's me and the girl. And What's up, baby? Org. I'm Marquise. Baby, baby. I'm joined by Stephanie Colombini. You having fun? It's your first hurricane. Hey, baby. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Of course, yeah, of course, it's the first in 90-some-odd years, so <laughs> interesting way to get used to a hurricane. Well, you've been keeping track of Manatee and Sarasota County. How are things there? Well, actually, just a few minutes ago, right at 3 a little o'clock, bit of rain. Manatee's a little bit of rain. mandatory curfew went into an effect. So that means you board it up. That the house is boarded up. live there, you need to stay inside and let uh, emergency responders do their thing. Actually, even they will not be on the roads now that the winds have gotten this bad. Um, so they called their emergency vehicles off at 1 p.m. The curfew went in at 3 p.m. That'll be in place until 3 p.m. tomorrow. So you got 24 hours uh -oh, to stay Uh-oh, we might inside. be done. Okay, it's 3.06. Oh, snap. Uh, one of our news team is uh, in full force today. We have not only a full staff of people here, but we also have reporters out in the field assigned by county and in Hillsborough County today is WUSF's Bobby O'Brien who joins us now. Hi, Bobby. Good afternoon. What have you been up to this morning and afternoon? Well, <laughs> um, I have taken two treks down to the Bay Shore. Um, the first one, I was observing uh, that the Tampa police had the um, ramps to Davis Islands blocked off. Davis Islands is a level A evacuation zone, so everybody is supposed to be gone from there. People aren't supposed to be going back. The um, And I also then monitored the mayor, who had his press conference and in, in, initiated Tampa's curfew, which he said would start at 6 o'clock. All right, y'all, let's roll in the store. 